Franklin Templeton Investments presents Behavioral Finance for Everyday Investors, creating awareness around concepts to help you with your long-term investing success. Today's lesson, Availability Bias. To illustrate what availability bias is, let's talk about sharks. The odds of being attacked by a shark in the U.S. are 1 in 11 and a half million. In fact, there are more fatalities from collisions with deer or even being buried in the sand at the beach than from shark attacks. With the odds clearly stacked in our favor, it would be safe to say that the rational among us would be totally comfortable going in past our ankles at the beach. Not so fast. What if you just watch Shark Week on the Discovery Channel, which, by the way, conveniently airs in the middle of summer? What's top of mind now? A statistic with lottery-sized odds favoring your safety, or an image burned into your mind of a South African great white with a hankering for seal tartare. Building a sandcastle may suddenly sound a lot more appealing than going for a swim. This is availability bias in action. Your rational mind knows that shark attacks are extremely rare, but if there is information available to you that is not only more recent, but more traumatic, it is likely to have a stronger influence on your decisions. Availability bias affects how people invest their money, too. For example, the stormy stock market of 2008 left vivid memories about the risks of investing in equities. Traumatic indeed. Some investors reacted to this experience by putting their money into cash equivalent investments. They wanted to feel safe. But with their money earning low yields, many investors started to feel like they were just treading water. Never mind the real threat of inflation taking a bite out of their purchasing power. So, what can you do? At Franklin Templeton, we believe working with a financial advisor is one of the best ways to avoid the true dangers threatening your portfolio. Mutual fund investments are subject to market risks. Read all scheme-related documents carefully.